One, two, three, wrestling walkers return. I haven't made videos in a while, and I'm sorry for being so stupid in all the other videos. You know, like, how to fall asleep. That was the stupidest video I've ever made. That video, how to sneeze, I really don't know how it got so many views, and people said it worked. I mean, for most of my videos, it just has one view, and I really don't like that. And I'm making a figure review on. Can't make this really long. Hurricane. It's a good figure, I mean, like. It's really, really, you don't see it in the stores. These are all the figures I've. Not all, because I had a lot. All the figures I bought while well, you guys were like, while well, I was taking a vacation. Hurricane. Good figure. Really good to trust. And the custom jump party I made. Uh, good figure. And then, I mean, if anyone has a good deal for this, I will trade you, but, um, but it'll have to be a good deal, because I'm only nine years old, and how good could a nine-year-old do? Then I got Michael Tarver. There's not a lot to say about this one. He has a Nexus sign right there. And he came in a two-pack with Fable Penguin still modeling. Then he has the skulls on his trunks. Sorry, just when I put him next to the camera, it's like doesn't show. Let's see. Then I got this Jeff Hardy figure. A really good face paint. I'm gonna customize the hair. And I'll make a, a review. Customize the armbands. And uh I already have a shirt for them and I'll try to find it right now. The belts I got during this time was the Intercontinental, the Intercontinental Old Tag Team Championship, the new, no, the Old Intercontinental Championship, the Tag Team Championship, because it goes with this one, the Tag Team Championship, and they became the Hardy Fashion. And that's really it, so how long has this video been? Two minutes and 29 seconds? Uh, I think I can have enough time for some things. Ah, oh, yes, I need to show you this. came out wicked good. Like, I'm only nine years old, and I think this came out better than some people who actually try and make caskets. Uh, probably the best casket I've ever made. See that? attached to something because like, now I'm gonna be a good example of how good this is okay put Michael McGillicuddy in it fits perfect and I'll put a bigger guy in it King. he fits perfect and he actually sucks in and a perfect casket and why would I use the other I, when I keep Boston Car he was in this kind of packaging and you just put stuff so you can see right here so you can eat. And then you just flip it over, tape some skeleton leaves on it, and, and there you got a casket. Then this also I have, uh, what else did I get rid of this? I made a walk over the station. Cool. And I got a lot more, just to get you to oh, yeah. I made this ramp for the wrestlers to walk down. It came out super nice. It's maybe about uh, about 31 inches. Yeah, 31 inches. Exactly 31 inches. You could tell it's 31 inches when you read this. It actually looks pretty good with walkways. I'll get a walkway on me. Uh, yeah, here's the walkway. I haven't used it in a while, so I'm saying about the pistol off that I made. But if you. I'll put it together right now. Uh, it looks pretty good. Can't say it's awesome, but it looks pretty good. And I'll do an example with a guy right there. Jeff Hardy is the eagle. And if he wants to walk down, it's like this. Uh, he done, 
dun dun dun. And one of the cool things is if someone walks like they're on top of the walk way Britain and they fall, the walkway will go like that and break. So it'll be like, oh my gosh, they're on the walkway. Oh and the walkway just broke. A lot more water than that problem than we have. And it's all the time I have for this so for you, so bye. Oh wait, did I show you this? Did I sh I might have shown you these two figures. Kane. I think you're awesome details and asking for uh and and Sinkara.